this the past couple of weeks and it's really like just staying in it. We, we've had spurts of where we tap into uh, being a good offense and hitting all phases, but it's really just doing that throughout the whole game. Uh, we started fast and did that last week, but we didn't do it all game and uh, just really just trying to stay consistent in our offense um, and really be efficient on first downs. How are you feeling? Feeling good. A lot better. Yeah. Nothing, nothing too. Yeah, yeah, nothing. Yeah, nothing. Yeah, yeah, no, I wasn't. Didn't get an AJ Brown burrito. Uh, <laughs> no, I hope not. There you go. Um, I guess obviously it must be kind of a special uh, game for you going back uh, sort of home this week after so many years in, in LA. Is that fair to say? Yeah, I would say just being able to go back uh, uh, in, in a different way, you know, being able to play uh, in, in SoFi Stadium, being able to have family and friends, go to the game, uh, really just going out there and just get a win in, in the hometown and uh, really get back on track and be able to have a successful game in front of family and friends. What's your, your experience? You know, I remember you talking before the, the year started about how different you expected Nashville to be. Mm -hmm. You know, what's kind of your experience like team-wise yeah, yeah, yeah. outside of the team, you know, just city-wise? Uh, yeah, uh, I mean, it's been, it's been everything and more, I would say, from the, from the, from the team aspect, uh, the players, the staff, uh, being able to be out and, and uh, just meet people in the city has been really, um, really a uh, great experience. Um, I did see it's going to be freezing next week, though. I did not know that was going to happen, but uh, it's still cool to be here in Nashville. Robert, how do you feel like this locker room has uh, kind of reacted to this three-game losing streak? It's always been a really great culture in the past. Do you feel like that's kind of something you turn the page, you guys can move forward? Yeah, I would say this team believes in each other, know uh, what we're capable of. I think guys are able to shake off um, the losses and really just try to focus on the game and do whatever it takes to get better. Uh, you see that in the daily preparation and meetings and uh, practice and uh, really just trying to get get and do whatever it takes um, to, to get a win and to execute to the, to the higher standard that we have. Get back on the field and try to turn a race and pass rush. How frustrating has it been having to kind of sit and watch? Man, it sucked. It sucked just been to watch my guys not, not being able to help. Yeah, it's a perfect time maybe to be coming back against a really good uh, – Offense in uh, LA. What makes him so good? I mean, they got weapons all over the place. Um, like I said, just the quarterback. He, he tried to. Uh, he got some guys on the outside. He get the ball to. He hold the ball. And stays in the pocket. So that's something that I've been looking at. Shane talked about the lack of turnovers. I know you've been watching the last couple of weeks. I mean, it seems like it's one of those things where they come in bunches, right? As soon as you get one, more will follow, right? Right. Like you just got to get better playing our ball and everything will fall in place. Thanks, Nico. Yeah. Appreciate it. How do you feel coming out of that first one, getting back on the field? Uh, I felt good. Like I said, um, just getting just getting you know, used to moving around on it and, you know, just changing directions, just small things. Just getting back used to get back on the field. I think I heard Brayville say, like, hey, you know, at your own pace, you're like, this is my pace. Coach, yeah. is it hard sometimes when you're out there and you got to maybe take it back a little? Yeah, it is because, you know, I want to check it out and see if everything is all right, you know, but I'm supposed to go a little slow on it and take my time on it. But I just got one gear. I'd like to say, I know the, the news has been great, but how much fun are you having making the plays you've been making lately? Uh, yeah, definitely it's fun making plays, but um, losing does mask that, though, so we definitely want to make plays and win the game. Do you have, like, when you get the ball in your hands in a little bit of space, do you kind of switch modes to where you go from tight end to, like, a running back now? Because it seems like you're looking for guys to run over. You look like you like to initiate contact. Yeah, I mean, I, for me, it's really just playing through everything. I just like to... You know, run through things. You know, I don't really need to juke as much. I feel like I'm strong enough to break tackles that way. So that's just my style of game. Everybody has their own style, and that's my style.